Hey, I'm George Diller from right, the PA of the right. Nation. You guys heard them. The, uh, but will each of you two say something? We are going to have to introduce them right in line, Jeff. Yeah. All right. Okay, I'll now, give you all of the introduction. Okay. Very good. Ready? You yeah, I'm ready to go. All right. Being on the threshold of picking up the countdown now for STS 117, we're pleased to have the entire astronaut flight crew here at the Kennedy Space Center to prepare for the launch. So I will introduce now to you Commander Rick Sturko. We'll have a few comments and then introduce the rest of his crew who will also have a few remarks. Rick? Good afternoon. It's great to be down here in Florida. We appreciate this great weather that you got for us today to fly in here. And uh, if you can just get some weather like this for us on Friday uh, evening, uh, we'll really appreciate that, too. The uh, crew is very excited to be in Florida. We spent a long time training for this mission. As you know, uh, we had a, a little bit of a, a setback. We were supposed to go in March. Uh, we especially appreciate all the great work that was done on ET-124, our external tank, uh, the repair teams, uh, and all the engineers and the testers and everybody that pulled together from uh, NASA to make that uh, story come together and to get the uh, tank ready to uh, fly. We appreciate them very much. We just flew by the uh, launch pad uh, 39 Alpha on our way in here. It looks great. At this time, I'd like to uh, introduce our uh, PLT, uh, uh, Mr. Uh, Colonel Lee Archambault. Brew, come up here and please uh, tell everybody what you're doing. Hi, uh, my name is Lee Archambault, and I'll be the uh, pilot on the mission. Uh, my duties, uh, in addition to uh, assisting our commander on the uh, flying uh, duties, will be on orbit, will be to be a robotics arm operator. I'll be working both the uh, space shuttle as well as the uh, space station robotic arm, uh, primarily assisting in the installation of the S3, S4 truss. Our uh, next crew member I'll introduce is our uh, MS-1, uh, Colonel Pat Forrester. I am Pat Forrester. I'm the MS-1. I'll be on the flight deck for uh, launch and for re-entry. I'll be doing the uh, second spacewalk and also be the prime arm, arm operator for pulling the S3-S4 truss out of the bay. And next is uh, Steve Swanson. Hello, my name is Steve Swanson. I'll be MS-2 on this flight. I will be doing the second EVA along with Pat and also being a robotic arm operator for both the shuttle arm and the station arm. And Dr. Daniel Levis is next. Good afternoon. My name is Daniel Levis, and I'll be assisting a gentleman who will be coming up here in just a second, Mr. Jim Riley, with the EVAs 1 and 3. I'll also be assisting in some of the shuttle robotics act activities, as well as uh, participating uh, with uh, CJ and Brew during the, the rendezvous. I'd like to introduce now uh, Mr. Jim Riley. Good afternoon. Uh, my name is Jim Riley, and uh, sorry uh, we're so late. Uh, sorry to keep you all waiting for us, but uh, we really appreciate the great weather, as CJ said, and uh, I get an opportunity to lead a great team out here on the spacewalks and work with a great team all together here for our flight. And uh, really looking forward to some great weather on Friday, and I appreciate everybody uh, out here to support. Thanks very much. And I'd like to uh, introduce uh, Clay Anderson, who will be taken up to station on this flight. Hi, my name's Clay Anderson, and uh, my primary duty on 117 is to go uphill and replace Sunny Williams to allow her to come home and uh, be with her friends and family. And then I'll uh, be with the Expedition 15 and the Expedition 16 crews uh, when uh, Expedition 16 arrives sometime in October. So I'll turn it back over to Commander Sturkow. All right, thanks a lot. Right, can you all stay for just a second? Let us get some Absolutely. Quick. Sure. Yeah, everybody uh, turn toward the middle. Turn toward the middle and bunch it up. They like to get it close there. Thank you, guys. 